Hey, what's up, guys? Jay Lama Sunny here, bringing you another unboxing. Today, we're unboxing the Audio Technica ATR 2100. And I got this from Amazon. I got two days shipping with uh, Amazon Prime. I guess it was like a new thing. I paid a, a dollar, I think it was. And yeah, and total, the, the mic was $35. And then I got a, a microphone uh, sleeve or a, a wind. I forgot what it's called, the windshield, and it pretty much makes it makes the quality better by stopping wind, and I'll probably end up getting a pop filter or something for this, if I like the quality enough. So, let's get on to it. Using this, I don't even know what it is, but I guess I'll do the job. Is that now let's open the other side. Okay. Ugh. Sorry about this guys. Alright, so there it is. There's the microphone. Point it up. Got some, some air, um, plastic bag. Alright, so here's a mic. So there it is. The Audio Technica. Um, does it even have the name on it? Um, oh, well, it has it right there. The ATR2100 USB. And it's a car, uh, cardio, cardio dynamic USB XLR microphone. So it has both XLR and USB. So that's a pretty cool function in case I ever get a mixer or something. Probably won't, but I guess the option's there. So it's pretty cool. Um, open that. Uh, oh, there's. Okay, this time I use scissors. There's some. Tape right here. Got that. Got those. So, throw the box off. Um, oh, I guess I ripped it a little. Oh well. Um, this is some really cheap. Um, sorry about that, guys. And we're back. Um, so, pull this out. Here it is. Oh. I forgot one little thing, the instructions. I got, it comes with a stand, as you can see it's right here. Right here. Okay, well, it's pretty much it. I don't think you guys want to see that. Um, so, here's the actual microphone. It feels really heavy, pretty good though. It feels um, like it's worthy of it. Um, Ido Technica. See if you guys can see that. It's the ATR2100. It's kind of like dirty. I don't know if it's been on the shelf for a while. Um, yeah, so. And then we got a stand for the tripod. Uh, it's a tripod clip. Sorry about that. Um, so that snaps on. Um, here's the tripod itself. Uh, it's pretty plasticky. Not that sturdy, but I guess it'll do the job. If it comes with it shipped, I hope it does. Um, here's a USB, Mac to USB. I think it's micro USB to USB. Yep. And then here's a USB. Um, and here's an XLR cable. This, I guess it's one play, uh, one way plug to the mic. Um, so I think it's this end. Yeah. So you plug it in. And then you plug this into the mixer in case you guys are doing a podcast or something. Um, yeah, so let's take that out. Alright, so I will be doing a sound test. It'll be on the same video. So I'll be right back for that. Alright guys, I'm back. Um, this is the Audio Technia ATR2100 that you're listening to right now. Eventually in this video, I will change this mic to my old one that I used to use for recording. So you guys can compare that, to, and I could also like compare it because I haven't really compared it. So I can compare that and see if it's a really big difference, and if it was really worth um thirty five dollars, 
which I think it pretty much was because I was listening to the audio. I tested it on, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see this. No, but I tested it on um, Audacity. And yeah, so it sounded pretty good. I just had to, it's very, very delicate. It's not delicate. So it's really hard. I had to speak really loud or not really loud, just a little bit louder than usual. Um, I'm trying to figure stuff out for that. It's not, yeah, I'm, I'm still speaking like usual right now. If I was playing with someone on Skype or something, but yeah, it's just, um, I guess it's a good thing because usually my brother is like behind me playing his Xbox or something. Um, so hashtag team Xbox. Oh, uh, you guys didn't hear that from me. All right. So let's, I'm on the audio technica ch uh, website because I didn't know what I have in the background. So I'm going to show you guys some specs of the, um, mic. So the ATR series and it's this one, it's a 2100 USB. And it's eighty dollars on this website for Amazon. I found it at thirty-five dollars. That's how much I pay for it. And I bought a sleeve. I might end up buying um, um, a pop filter if it's really that bad. If let me practice. P -p pop filter. Okay. Um, <laughs> I sound really stupid. But whatever. You guys aren't here to judge me, are you? Please don't judge me. All right. Um, I'm really weird. I need help. Okay, so I'm gonna eventually buy a pop filter. I did buy a wind sleeve, or a wind, windscreen, and that's what it's called. I've been calling it a windscreen, uh, wind sleeve the whole time, but it's a windscreen. So um, yeah, it was only three bucks. It was recommended for this mic. Um, so we'll check it out to see if that work. It works for this uh, specific mic, or else I'll just buy a pop filter. I mean, it's not really a big deal. All right, so that's the pictures. Uh, the bottom, I don't know if I really showed it to you guys, but this is the where you plug in the USB. So you plug in the micro USB to the mic and then your USB to the computer. And then this is uh, to higher and lower the volume for your, you can plug in your headphone. Like, I think if I would ever use it, I'd plug in my Apple headphones just so I can hear like what I sound like. Um, I'm not exactly using it right now, but I probably should have, but oh well. Um, so I'm, you plug that into there, your mic or your headphones, and then you can like higher the volume and stuff. Just, but for now, since I'm not using it, I can actually if I um, move the I forgot what it's called, just like the scrolling thing, my bobber, to higher the volume. Um, I believe right now it just, ch it, yeah, it hires my volume on my computer. So that's pretty cool, I guess. Um, I don't think I'll ever use it, but still. Uh, so yeah, let's get on to this. Uh, uh, you can read that if you want. So pause it there. Um, what I really want to show you guys it's um, built-in headphone jack. Uh, uh, all right, so it's a 16-bit, 44.148 uh, kilohertz per second. Or I don't even know what that is actually. So <laughs> I might sound really stupid. Um, it's compatible with Windows and Mac. If you guys were um, wondering if it worked for Mac. I am running Windows. I have a a gateway computer. And I've never really put the specs on the, of my computer on the channel, but I don't think it's necessary. It's not the best computer, so um, I mean, it's rec I recommend it if you guys are barely starting out. I think I got it for like 350, my computer, and it has a uh, four gigabyte of RAM, DDR3, and uh, an AMD quad core processor, A6, and then a uh, AMD Radeon HD 6520 uh, gigabytes, and then, or er, I don't even know what it is. It has a G, and then 512 megabits graphics system memory. So it has its own built in um, uh, display thing, because it, I guess, it has a really good or er, decent uh, video card. So that's pretty cool. I mean, and then, yeah, so. Alright, so let's get back to this. Um, so uh, USB and XLR cables are included. Um, you guys already saw that in the boxing specification. So um, it's dynamic, it's cardioid. Um, frequency 50, 50 to one or fifteen hundred. Fifteen. <coughs> sorry, I burped. Fifteen hundred, and then it's is that fifteen hundred? No, that's fifteen thousand. Okay. Fail. <laughs> uh, uh, power requirements: USB power. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Depth. Uh, bit depth. Uh, 16 bit and then sample rate controls it la 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 3.5 this is the what I was talking about it's the headphone jack so you can plug in your headphones to the mic and listen to what you sound like 
and you could still use like something else to listen to your computer. Um, so it comes with a stand clamp. You guys already saw this. So um, downloads. This is manual, optional windscreens and mounts. What's this? Hmm. Not available in your world. Okay, I guess. I guess they're very racist to Americans. Okay, so um, all right. So now I'm gonna change it to my old headphones. Be right back. All right, I'm I'm back. Um, this is my old microphone. The um, let me read again. The LabTech Axis 102. Uh, sounds that good. I actually, I'm gonna use the Turtle Beach X12 as my headphones now, and the new microphone as my mic. So, um, let me know what you guys think of the comparison. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like. And um, one thing I really want to ask you guys: please spread like my channel and stuff. Um, I've been stuck around like 30 uh subscribers, which is great. I mean, I started with 17 when I started recording again and I've gotten like 13 new subscribers so thank you guys that are you guys are new here I really appreciate it I do put a lot of time and effort into this right now I'm not really playing Minecraft because I'm really um, focused on my schoolwork but on the weekends I will record a lot and probably starting next week I might be doing like more recent uploading maybe every day I mean I don't promise it but I'll try I'll probably end up doing um I'll probably upload it as a timed one so you guys can like see it once it'll probably up it's gonna be uploaded and then it's re released to the public um on the time I set it to so maybe uh I usually do it at 11:30 a.m. uh Pacific Standard Time so yeah so uh like I said please tell your friends about me it's really much appreciated maybe if we hit 50 subscribers we'll do a little special um video or vlog um. I don't know if some of you guys have seen my face, but maybe I'll do a, uh, uh, I don't know, something special. I'll think about it, but, uh, so help me get to my goal, guys. Uh, so thanks for watching, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like, subscribe if you are new to the channel, and peace out.